Z-E-R-O Subscribe to the page if you're new Cause I'm dropping new video every day This week vlog springs coming soon No trip baby But in the meantime you can't just vibe with me Hey, gang Yo today we about to talk about Five things girls do That guys hate when y'all first start talking Hey, y'all already know how we about to do this, man. Look, my biggest thing now, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, I want the likes, the comments, and everything. But the biggest thing now, we need to get these views up, baby. You feel me? We need to get the views up. So share, share, share. If you watch the video, you like it. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you share it to somebody. Share it to, like, three people, bro. Because your three people could share it to more three people. And, you know, it just keep that cycle going. So make sure you share. But anyways, let's get into the video. I don't know why I shot your scream, I'm sorry. <laughs> Number one, bro, this is my main thing. Going through my phone. Girl, I don't even know you like that. Damn. Real, like, real talk though, like, I don't even know you like that for you to really be going through my phone. Like, I mean, I know you enough to really, you know what I'm saying? Beat them cheeks, you know what I'm saying? But other than that, I don't even know you like what you doing. I don't even know you like that. Like, damn. Look, check this out. I already know what y'all thinking right now. Oh, niggas ain't shit. And you see me? I agree with you, baby. Like, they ain't, they ain't shit. You know what I'm saying? But see me? I'm different. Like, I'm not even like them other dudes. <laughs> Oh <laughs> uh, shit, look, you gotta watch my last, my last video to understand that though. <laughs> Number two, like legit, this happened to me when I was talking to a girl one time. Saying or introducing me as your boyfriend to other people, like when we legit just talking or just started talking. For real though, that legit happened to me one time. And when I tell you, that was like a big turn off of me. Like that was like a huge turn off. Like I'm like, boyfriend, like what? Hey. Hey, call it. Hey, call it. <laughs> well, I'm, girl, when I became your boyfriend, girl, it's your boyfriend, girl, chill out, call it, like. <laughs> and I like, don't get me wrong, like you know what I'm saying. The girl I was messing, like we was messing with each other, tough, like you feel me, like I was really, like we was really messing with each other, like we was really feeling each other on some stuff, you know what I'm saying. But at the same time, it's just like, I wasn't like on that level, you know what I'm saying? So I had to ask her like, why you, you know, call people, like, why you telling people like, I'm your boyfriend, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, and after I asked her that, she basically just kind of explained it to me like, she said it was just an easy way for her to like, introduce me to people instead of just saying like, oh, this the boy I'm talking to right now, or like, you know, this the person like I'm dealing with right now, you know what I'm saying? And I was like, oh, you know what I'm saying? That makes sense. But at the same time, I'm like, bro, you could just be like, oh, look, Look, this Josh, Josh, this my people, or, you know, something like that, you feel me? Like, that boyfriend thing was just like a little overboard for me. I'm like, whoa, boyfriend? That's crazy. I don't know, some people might like that. Like, if you messing with somebody and they just, like, introduce you as, like, they boyfriend or they girlfriend, like, y'all might like that. But see me, I just wasn't at that place yet, you feel me? Like, I was, like, real, like, you know, kind of scared of relationships at that point. Because I'm like, I just got out. I'm like... Oh, you know what I'm saying? We moving a little too fast type shit, you feel me? Like, I'm like, uh-uh, I ain't even know yet, you feel me? Like, that just, like, kind of pushed me, like, all the way back, you feel me? I'm like, I can't mess with that, like, mm-mm, mm-mm. Number three, I legit said this in a video before, um, but when you just start talking to somebody and all they talk about or want to talk about is their ex, like, Bro, this legit our first date, and you know what I'm saying? You talking about this nigga? I don't even want to hear nothing about this nigga. I'm trying to know more about you and what you like, you feel me? But you still stuck on this nigga. At the beginning though, whatever we got going is not the time for that, you feel me? Like, yeah, maybe like one day, like when we on the topic, you feel me? Like, then we could like talk about it, you know what I'm saying? Like legit, it's our first date and you talking about your ex. Yeah, my ex this, my ex that. Well look, exit your ass out the rest of one day, you know what I'm saying? Cause I don't wanna hear about this nigga the whole time. I'm trying to learn about you, you feel me? I'm trying to see whatever we got going, what we doing with this and you still talking about this nigga? Bro, you know what I'm saying? Like maybe like later down the relationship or like whatever we got going, you know what I'm saying? We gonna get on that topic, we gonna talk about it, you know, vent about it and things like that, you feel me? Cause nobody wanna make like the same mistakes as your ex did you feel me so i understand that like 
of course y'all gonna have like that conversation about your ex but like all the time or like in the beginning stage it's like no that's like a, like a turn off like you know what I'm saying like you feel me and then like oh another thing bro like I kind of saw this like on like Instagram or something like when like uh, anybody you know what I'm saying it's the dude or female when they bang they pass problems into that they current relationship you feel me like whatever that person did i don't got nothing to do with that person they don't got nothing to do with me you feel me like me and that person is not the same so like you can't put what they did on me like i feel like you know of course like you know what i'm saying whoever got hurt gonna have their guard up you feel me like i ain't saying like don't have your guard up but i'm just saying like anything that they did you can't just put that on me because we not the same, I'm not that person, I'm not, whatever they did to you, I didn't, you feel me? So you can't just put that charge on me like that. Number four, pressuring me into a relationship. Lord, Lord. Pressuring someone into a relationship, like, for real though? Don't do that, don't do that. Cause like, if you pressure somebody into doing something and they do it and they hard not into it, you know what I'm saying? That shit go in like, like that, you feel me? Like a snap of a finger. So don't pressure nobody into a relationship. Now, if like legit, this is how I look at it. If you talking to somebody for a little minute, like you know what I'm saying, some months down the line, you feel me? Um, it's kind of like known like what y'all doing. Like especially if y'all just kind of messing with each other, it's kind of like known what y'all doing, and we all possibly could have that. But at the same time, I know some people, some some females, you know, want to like you know probably ask that question like, what we doing? You feel me? So, you know what I'm saying, that's kind of, that's understandable, you feel me? If you ask somebody, you know what I'm saying, you been talking to them, talking to them for a little minute, and you be like, you know, what we doing? That's cool, you feel me? But, you know what I'm saying, fucking punching a relationship in their face? Bitch, ask me out. Ask me out. Mm, I want to be your boyfriend. Make me your boyfriend. When you gonna ask me out? When you gonna ask me out? Number five, when a girl, like, be ducking you, you feel me? Like, if you don't want to mess with a nigga, Say that, you feel me? Like, you know what I'm saying? You'll hit a girl up like, you know, hey, we gonna chill a day, like, what's up? You know what I'm saying? You gonna come through or I'ma come through type shit. And they be like, yeah, around this time, you feel me? Then, like, that time coming, like, they flaking on you and stuff like that. Bro, like, if you legit don't wanna hang out with somebody, or if you don't wanna do something with somebody, or you don't even wanna talk to that person, say that, don't be wasting somebody's time and, like, beating around the bush. Like, you just wasting both of our time right now, you feel me? But the last one, this is, like, the most important one, bro. Like, this is, like... This is very important, like, when you just start talking to a girl, and like, all they want to get from you is like, your booty, like, they just want your private part, like, bro, I'm more than just a penis, you know, like, it's real more than that, like, why don't you just try to get to know me more, or like, just spend some time with me before you just trying to get me in your bed like that's wrong like who does that like girls have that bad bro i can't no i just started talking to you like a day ago and you talking about my penis like what about me <laughs> yeah that's just a couple things you know what i'm saying that i hate when you first start talking to somebody it's way more you feel me but look I might do a part two with Kenny if this video get a certain amount of views. You feel me? So make sure you share this video, like, comment, subscribe, but comment down some things that like when you first start talking to a dude, like what you hate that they do. You feel me? So make sure you comment that down. And if you're a dude, you already know, comment some things that, like I said, you feel me? And uh, you already know, man, going on this week long thing. You feel me? If you new, join the wavy babies. You heard me? So. That's it, bro. To the next video. Shout out to all my wavy babies and a bunch, bro. <laughs> we out.